Hey little bees, it's your favorite fame boy here, Baby Barnum, aka B Squared. And today I have to elaborate on, um, there was like a Facebook post and like an Instagram pic that I did like a few days ago or whatever. And it was like one of my new little bees, he's just like Toads of George Ginger. Um, I named him Coco because his real name wasn't good enough. So I gave his name a little flavor. Um, you know, despite the fact, you know, that he's like an adorable ginger, but like ginger silly flavor, okay. Um, yeah, but anyway, so like, and um, I've made the comment that gingers are like unicorns, you know? Um, and I have to explain why. Okay, so like, gingers are like totes rare. Like, if there's anybody in like the human race that's rare, it's gingers, you know? And um, all the unicorns are rare. Like, like, have you seen a unicorn? Like, I haven't seen a unicorn. But I still like to believe that they exist, you know? Um, so, like, I kind of think that, like, you know, genders are kind of, like, the human equivalent of unicorns. It's, like, you know, like, how many genders do you know? Personally, like, you could count, like, less than them on your hand. Less than them... Um, yeah, like, you know, like, less than, like, five of them. Um, so, yeah. And, like, and they're just totes, like, like, kind of, like, really just magical to look at, you know? Because, like, people with red hair, like, naturally, they don't come along very often. So, you know, you're just kind of like, whoa, like, I have to stare at you, you know? And it's like, if you saw a unicorn running by, like, you'd obviously have to stare at that. And... And then, of course, like, gingers are usually, like, always really pale. So that's another reason why you have to stare at them. Because cause they're, like, just so bright, you know? And, like, light just, like, just, like, like, reflects and, like, goes off of them. You know? And it's, like, like, OMG, like, a ginger's coming. I need to get my shades. Hey. Um, hey, where are my shades? Do you know? That's okay. That's fine. I, if I had them, I would put them on. But I jumped right now. They're, like, over there somewhere. Um, yeah, okay, but anyway. Yeah, and so, like, yeah, and unicorns are, like, toad's adorbs. And, like, gingers are kind of toad's adorbs. Like, I know, like, a lot of people say that it's, like, oh, gingers don't have souls. It's, like, OMG, bitches. Like, stop copying Cartman from, like, South Park. Like, get a life, okay? Like, Gingers are amazing, you know? And then it's like, oh, like, did you, like, do you not see Ed Sheeran? He's like, tons of doors. And I'm like, and I'm like, like, the little Harry Potter kids, you know, like the, the, like, the redhead ones, like, they're tons of doors. And now, like, my new little bee, Coco, he's a ginger, and he's tons of doors. And, oh, yeah, and he was making that funky face because he just ate a mint. And he really likes mints. So. So he's obviously going to be like minty fresh, and and freshness is good. And I would imagine that like like unicorns would be fresh. So so yeah. Okay. So like I think that everybody needs to stop and like and think like like hey, let's like stop saying that gingers don't have souls because they obviously do because they're like totes nice. Like like I feel like like most gingers that like like I've ever met are always really nice. You know, and, like, Coco's really nice, and Ed Sheeran's really nice, and then, like, I met, like, two other gingers, and they're really nice. Um, yeah, so, like, so they must have souls. So this whole, like, oh, gingers don't have souls thing from South Park, like, that's bull. But that's bull poop. Bull poop, peeps. Okay, so little bees, um, yeah, hashtag redheads are unicorns. Keep it going. Okay. And like next time you see your red hair, be like, oh, I'm cheap. You're totes of dwarves. You have a soul and you're a unicorn. Okay. All right. I love you, little bees. Bye.